ones who have found the driver's license. Saturday, April 13th, and I uh, <laughs> I came out to Dash, so I, I've already done an order. It was a Chick-fil-A order, and I'll put that on the screen real fast. $9.31, 4.6 miles for Chick-fil-A. I am taking it. This is a meet at the door, so I'm going to put you away. I'll show you the fish when we leave them. As I was uh, walking up to the door to deliver the Chick-fil-A, it was the meat at the door. I got another order. It was an ABC Fine Wine and Spirits order for like $9.47, six items, and so I accepted that. And so I was, I went into my purse to get my driver's license to take in there just in case they asked me for it and I can't find my driver's license. I took everything out of my purse. It's not in my purse. I looked like, you know, like around here, like, you know, did I set it down? Um, you know, it's, it, I don't see it. Um, so I just called my daughter and told her to look on my desk at home, but I don't believe it would be on my desk at home because I had no reason to take it out at home. So I don't know where it is. The only thing that I can think of is that one of the times that I had taken it out um, to bring into the store to do Uber Eats, because you know if I'm doing a DoorDash I just bring my whole purse um, since I have to use the red card anyways, but for Uber Eats you know I just use my phone so to pay so I just bring in the ID. So I'm thinking I must have dropped it while shopping. So I'm I'm waiting to hear back from my daughter. She's looking for it. And I'm heading to the ABC that I usually go to to see if I dropped it there. Maybe they found it. Um, and then the only other liquor uh, place where I would have had it out is Winn-Dixie Liquor. I did do a Winn-Dixie Liquor shop sometime last weekend. I don't remember this week I don't remember when it was but I've been there so I'm gonna I'm gonna check there too um, so I dropped the ABC order you know I can't um, I can't uh, I'm not supposed to be out here driving with no driver's license you know what I'm saying um, I looked online to see you know there's there's no like DMV open on the weekend so I wouldn't even like be able to try to get a replacement until Monday which means that I can't dash this whole fucking weekend unless one of these places I'm checking right now has my driver's license <sighs> that really sucks that really sucks because not only am I not going to earn the money that I'd earn being out here dashing because you know the weekend is where I'm making the majority of the money but then I'm also not gonna have content to post until I get my driver's license back which that screws up my YouTube earnings do you see what I'm saying y'all I'm irritated right now and my daughter has not answered me back
Potato, did you look on the desk? Did you see it anywhere? I don't know where it can be. Um, you know, because even when I get back in the car with my things, like, I'm just the type of person I do things in the same order, the same the same way. You know what I mean? So I don't forget things. And so I know when I come back in the car, I always put my license back in my purse. I always do. So the only thing that could have happened is that I was carrying it in the store and dropped it and didn't realize that I did. And hopefully somebody found it and has it. So in, instead of a dashing video, uh, what you're getting is a uh, meaty mama is searching for her driver's license so she hopefully doesn't have to reorder one video. favorite ABC. I don't even drink alcohol, but holy crap, y'all. Holy crap. Oh my God. Thank you, Jesus. Let me tell my daughter. Potato, I found it. I came to the ABC that I always shop at and they found it and they had it. So I have it now. <sighs> y'all. Well, that's you ain't kid. All right. <laughs> oh my lord. Let me um. <laughs> let me get back on. Oh, the DoorDash is gonna let me dash for 45 minutes. That is so generous of them. Oh my god, I was having a cow. Well, not really having a cow, but um, I was feeling a little bit stressed. I was feeling a little bit stressed. Okay. Okay, so um I need to I need to adjust the amount that I earned. Minus the 947. So I've only made 931 so far today. I've been out for an hour. Let's see what you got. $4.25, 3.5 miles for Chipotle. I don't want that. And then six dollars thirty-seven cents, three point five miles for Chick-fil-A. No, I would if it was a better drop-off, I would have taken that one, but um, it's not quite the two dollars per mile. If it was a better drop-off, I would have taken it though. All right, driver's license acquired. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, ABC. Thank you, the workers here. Oh my God, I love you. May you be blessed forever and ever and ever. $6.25. 3.9 miles for Chipotle. Not taking it. $5.50, 6.9 miles for Chick-fil-A. Not taking it. $5.75, 3 miles for Chipotle. Not taking it. Six dollars and fifty cents, three point one miles for Chick Fil A. I will accept it. I have Alicia, Alicia M. It's gonna be okay. No problem. This one is going to Publix, Publix Pharmacy. I'm never gonna get out of this, out of this spot. What? 
What is that noise for? Oh, now this person's moving. Oh my God. It is so busy at this Chick-fil-A right now. It is insane. All right, let me out. Let me out. So my goal for today is $150. Like last weekend, my goal for the weekend overall is 300. So 150 for both Saturday and Sunday. And hopefully, you know, the whole license thing didn't put me behind too much and I can get caught up. Also yesterday, I was going to come out and dash on Friday and do like a little dinner, a little dinner dash, but my son's been sleeping late. He seems tired again. And so we slept in and Take the next got up late. Tyrone Boulevard North. That's what I'm doing. Um, and then what? Um, so we, we got up late and then you, you ever just, you ever just get in the mood to clean? That's the kind of mood I was in yesterday. So I spent like two to three hours cleaning. It was a beautiful day, opened the windows. It was cool, bright, breezy, and just wonderful. So I cleaned, made lunch, we ate, and then I had to do uh, editing for the video that needed to come out yesterday. And it took me longer than expected. So I never did end up coming out and dashing, but it was such such a peaceful lovely day with the windows open and everything it was really quiet like the neighbors were quiet oh it was wonderful it was so wonderful Yeah. I just gotta take a quick picture of it before okay. we leave it. All right, all set. Thank, Thank you. you. I don't know if you can see it. It's 10:25, 5.6 miles. It's an Aldi shop for 28 items for ten dollars. Crazy. Trying to match to a six dollar nineteen cent ABC uh, order. I think it was three items for three miles. Waiting, waiting. Enter your pickup All at right. ABC Fine Wine and Spirits, Tyrone Square. Let's do it. I am bringing in my entire purse and I am never taking my driver's license out of my purse again. <laughs> three bags of ice. I don't need my purse. Three bags of ice. All right. Do you have 10 times? No. <laughs> All right. Let me stop. Let me stop. Ooh, the GoPro's gonna get too hot because the dash is too hot. That's just a two dollar order. Let's not worry about it. But my dash ended. My little bitty baby dash ended. So let me get back on there. Woo! They gave me all the times. So I'm gonna put till eight. Eight. Eight dollars seventy five cents. Seven point five miles for the speedway. Just shush. For the speedway. Nah. Five dollars, 2.5 miles for the Chipotle. It fits the criteria, so I'm taking it.
$3.25, miles for Chick-fil-A. That is a no. Check this out. $2.75, 5.3 miles, ABC liquor for six items. Decline. Six dollars and fifty cents, five point seven miles for chilies. No, it doesn't seem like it doesn't even seem like a Saturday today. I've at this point only made um, twenty seven dollars. Twenty seven dollars, and it's it's almost three thirty now. I kind of feel like this whole day is kind of wasted. I don't see how I'm gonna earn a hundred and fifty dollars today because I need a hundred and thirty more dollars. McDonald's, five dollars, 1.2 miles. Oh, I accepted it, but wait. Uh, six dollars, 54 cents, 13 miles for five guys. Y'all are insane. They're killing me with these little crap five dollar orders, but like, they're the only ones that have been like two dollars per mile. Now I'm tired. And there's like a loose hair touching me. You don't know when there's like a loose hair and it's like tickling you. And now my phone says no internet connection. I just feel like. <laughs> oh man. I came out here today like I was rip roaring to go. You know, I was like, I was ready. Because last, week, last weekend was a great weekend. And I'm like, you know, we can do that again. Let's get out there. Let's get $300. You know, it's going to be a good time. And then, and then I got to that ABC and couldn't find my driver's license. And that just like, that shook the whole day, baby. That shook it up. And it's not the same. And now it's like slow. Take the next ride onto Tyrone Boulevard North. Then make a U-turn at 66th Street North. Running around for $5. Sprite machine is down, so I don't okay. have that to give them. Let me see. Okay. okay. I'll text them and see what they say. They'll take a regular Sprite. Okay. That's all right. Thank you so much. That's mine. I just hope I gave them a large one. It's mine. Okay. Another one, 225, 3.4 miles for ABC, two items. Absolutely insane. First of all, regardless if the customer tiffed or not, 225 base pay for an alcohol order? I don't think so. I'm really not feeling it, like. $13.26, miles for Torchies. Like I'm seriously about to turn the turn these off and just go home. Eight dollars twenty five cents. Eight dollars twenty five cents. Five point eight miles for Portillo's. That's taking me right over in Kaka Land, and I don't want to go over there. I mean, I. I'm I'm being one hundred percent honest with y'all. I just. It's 3.46, so, I mean, I should just go home. I should go home, and I have a video that needs to be edited, and if I feel like it, I'll come out for dinner. I mean, that's what it feels like right now. Because, like, I've been, I've been out here for three hours, and I've made $30, okay? Now, I did take a break. 
that I did, you know, have to find my license. So that affected that. But even still, like these orders are terrible. The only acceptable orders coming to my phone are $5 orders. It's terrible. This is the outro. It's, it is boy, 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 boy. All right, so anyways, um, listen, I'm just like, I'm not, I'm just not gonna stay out here and waste my time, especially when I have things to do at home. If I'm out here and all, all I'm getting is crap and the best orders I'm getting are $5 orders and I've made $30, in three hours, why would I stay out here and waste my time? They can kiss my ass because I'm just out here declining orders. What good is that? So I'm gonna go home. I have videos to edit. I'm gonna edit those videos and there's always things to clean and organize, etc. Or you know what, I could read or I could take a nap or watch a show with my kids. Um, whatever, you know what I'm saying? whatever so I'm gonna go home and we'll see how it goes if I feel like coming back out like for dinner shift I'll do that I'll come out for a couple hours if I feel like it and I'll make that into a different video but if I don't feel like it then I won't so on DoorDash today we made a whopping $16.50 yes we did And on the oobs, all of the chips have come, all of the chips have come in on my two orders. So that has come to $15.50. So if we add $16.50 plus $15.50, that gives us $32. I was out here for three hours, but I did take a 30 minute break to get gas and all that. And so let's divide this by 2.5. And that means that we made $12.80 an hour. Um, the miles that I drove today equaled 25 and I did get gas, um, as I have mentioned. That was $42.08. I don't remember how much it was per gallon. I think it was like $3 and 30 something cents. So it's really like I made nothing. I made nothing today. I made nothing. This really wasn't how I was. Boy, I tell you. This was not how I was planning for Saturday to go. I, I, I'm bummed about it. I'm bummed about it because last weekend was so good. So please like, subscribe, and share. I'm going to go into Winn-Dixie and buy some freezer bags and take a look at, oh, and rice. And I'll take a look at the meat and see if there's anything on sale because if there's meat on sale, I'll buy it. And I'll put it in my freezer because that's how I do it. Okay. Okay. Thanks for watching. Bye.